Hello everyone. Today I will explain to you the configuration tutorial of the prefix and suffix of the General Scan Scanner integrated with the Zebra Scanning Engine. General Scan barcode scanners with integrated Zebra Scan engines can be configured with up to one prefix character and two suffix characters. For character configuration, you need to refer to the ASCII character set in the configuration manual. Today we demonstrate by adding bracket characters. We need to refer to the ASCII code character set of the configuration manual to find that the character of the left bracket is 1091 and the character of the right bracket is 1093. Then, we refer to the alphanumeric barcode mapping table in the configuration manual and after finding the corresponding number barcode, we can configure it. Next, let's test a barcode sample first. This barcode sample does not have any prefix or suffix characters, and the suffix only has carriage return and line feed. First, let's test adding a prefix character, adding a left square bracket to the sample barcode. The first step, scan the scan prefix barcode. The second step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the left square bracket 1091. 1091. In the last step, scan the prefix data barcode to end the setup. As we can see in the video, the prefix left square bracket of the barcode output has been added to the sample barcode. Below, we demonstrate how to add a suffix closing bracket character. The first step is to scan the scan suffix 1 barcode. The second step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket 1093, 1093. The third step is to scan the data suffix 1 barcode to complete the setting. In the test video, we can see that the suffix right square bracket of the barcode output has been added to the sample barcode. Below, we demonstrate the ability to add prefixes and suffix characters at the same time. The first step, scan the scan prefix barcode. The second step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the left square bracket 1091, 1091. The third step is to scan the scan suffix 1 barcode. In the fourth step, Scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket 1093, 1093. Step 5. Scan the barcode of prefix data suffix 1 to end the setting. In the test video, we can see that the left and right square brackets of the barcode output have been added to the sample barcode. Below, we demonstrate the ability to add a prefix character and two suffix characters at the same time. For the second suffix character, we still add the closing bracket character. The first step, scan the scan prefix barcode. The second step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the left square bracket 1091-1091. The third step is to scan the scan suffix 1 barcode. The fourth step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket 1093-1093. The fifth step is to scan the scan suffix 2 barcode. The sixth step, scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket 1093-1093 respectively. The seventh step, scan the barcode of prefix data suffix 1 suffix 2 and the setting. In the test video, we see that a prefix left bracket and two suffix right brackets have been added to the sample barcode. Below, we demonstrate the ability to add two suffix characters at the same time. For the second suffix character, we still add the closing bracket character. The first step is to scan the scan suffix 1 barcode. The second step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket 1093-1093. The third step is to scan the scan suffix to barcode. 
The fourth step is to scan the number barcode corresponding to the right square bracket, 1093-1093. The fifth step, scan data suffix 1 suffix 2 barcode, end the setting. In the test video, we can see that the two suffix right brackets of the barcode output have been added to the sample barcode. Thank you for watching. General Scan. Scan Mobile World. Decode Creative Future.